In this episode, we delve into mean reversion bots. If the market's range bound in an area of congestion, sometimes the best thing to do is just to stand down, not to bother trading. There's not enough volatility or action. If you do want to trade, though, um, frequently, if there's lack of participation, a mean reversion bot where you would fade conclusionary order flow would do well. Let me show you what that would look like. I'm going to go over here and let's go to the whiteboard. So here's a cute little lunchtime trade where the market could be quiet. The market could be going range bound, back and forth. We know there's not much doing. However, if you're an order flow person, you may know that right down here, there's going to be a clunk in the order book. The orders are going to get swept out of the order book. And this is one thing that order flow algorithms are very good at hunting down. And also, if you're using a bot, you can tell the bot, hey, look for that sweep of the order book down there. And once the order book gets swept out in this quiet market, I want to fade that and take a scalp up here for maybe three or four ticks. Here's an example of where the market's meandering. We're in lunchtime. This is Eastern. And what you can often do is just look for a price to move outside the Bollinger Band. Look for some conclusionary selling, either the yellow dot or this hammer down with the, I don't know if you can see it, there's a white bar on it, and fade that up. You'll see it came down again, outside the Bollinger Band, the yellow with the red bar with the white band around it, fade that up. Market came down again, red bar with the white hammer, or the, the red hammer bar with the white band around it, fade that up. So there's a lot of different ways to use Skeetobots, even in a quiet market, for fading things and just catching quick little scalps in here. If you like what you see, take Skeetobots for a test drive.